Earl Walker enjoyed his first meal of 2020. Walker, just one of many who started the new year at the Loving Arms Soup Kitchen on the Upper East Side. The facility operated by the Bronx Parent Housing Network is up and running thanks to an anonymous donor. So being that this is in the, right in the neighborhood, it was good for me to uh, find a good place like this. What's your name, my brother? Victor Rivera, founder of the Bronx Parent Housing Network, which received the donation, was initially reluctant to open the kitchen in what's considered to be one of the wealthiest neighborhoods in the borough. But he soon learned why the location was selected by the donor, who not only paid for the food, but also leased the space. We came out and we were walking through the neighborhood and one day I was in front of this site and someone came up and asked me for a dollar because they were hungry. And so I started saying, wow, 86th Street, New York City. Rivera kicked off the new year handing out meals with City Council member Ben Callos, who represents the district. The kitchen opens as the Trump administration announces drastic changes in the federal food stamps program known as SNAP, which may result in tens of thousands of New Yorkers losing access to benefits. SNAP, even at the current level, isn't enough, and we need soup kitchens like this to supplement SNAP because you can't live on a couple of dollars a day. The pop-up soup kitchen will be open to Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays for lunch and dinner, and has enough funding that will keep it open through the end of the year. On the Upper East Side, I'm Andrew Ramos, PIX11 News.